welcome back to another planning life with Erin. I am Erin and in today's video I am going to be planning in my classic vertical and I'm going to be planning for the week of May 2nd through May 8th and I cannot believe that we are already in May and Saturday is my daughter's birthday and Sunday is Mother's Day. Crazy how fast time goes. Okay. So today I have a lot of different things going on. First, I have birthday stickers for Saturday for my daughter's birthday. I'm using a uh, year of planning by Whimsy Lux. I love these stickers, they're so, so pretty. So I'm gonna be using these and then I'm not sure what else I'm pulling in. I was looking at Calico Plan Flourishing Florals. I'm really liking these neutral florals um, or possibly wellness because I do like some of these quotes in here. Um, let me see specifically. I like, oh, where is it now? I was liking, if I can find it. Where'd it go? There it is. Dwell in possibility. I really like this flower and I think it would go well with these colors. So I'm just gonna kind of let this thread take me wherever it takes me and let's see what happens. So I'm really happy you're here on this journey with me today. If you are new, hello. If you are returning, welcome back. Um, and let's get going. Grab my wax paper and get this planning on the road. I hope everybody's having a fantastic week. Been a little crazy in the Heinzel house. We've had my daughter was sick last week, and now my son's sick. It's been good times, but we're all making it through. And now mommy is just hoping she does not get sick for Mother's Day or for my daughter's birthday, really. I won't be sick at all. Thank you. No, okay, let's see. So, typically, I start on the left side, but I think, I don't know. I think I might start with the birthday girl day. And what do we need for a birthday? We need all the things. Big pink cake, absolutely. Do we wanna do it at the top? I don't really have much going on. Friday, I just need to make sure I have a list, a checklist for things that I might still need to get for Saturday. As far as I know, uh, my parents are going to be coming over, have birthday dinner, and then they'll be back again on Saturday, I mean on Sunday for Mother's Day. So that'll be nice. Nice weekend with my folks. All right, let's see. Pink, pink box for the birthday girl, because I think I might want to run it sideways. So let's see. Scooch that over. And put oh, straight is helpful so I can get a good idea. And then I don't think I mind if the cake kind of overlaps it a bit. I don't want to stick it on there so I'm probably get stuck <clears throat> until I'm certain. Be happy. That's cute. Maybe on the side. So when I was thinking about adding in the florals, I was thinking about putting something along the sidebar because I would typically use it. But now that I'm sitting here looking at it, I might be able to use, you know, just make it all birthday themed. So let's see what I can. And then maybe I can put a box, just a small box for my reminder. So instead of doing it on Friday, I can have a box here on the sidebar for any to-dos and anything I might need to get. Let's see. Place that there for now. And we need some cake. Kind of scattering these all out. I'm just kind of putting things down. If you guys have been here for a little bit, kind of notice that I just kind of start throwing things down on the paper. And then as I go, I kind of start laying it out and it starts to make sense. Oh, so I have a new ring light. I don't know if you guys can tell. <laughs> I have a nice new lighting going on. Um, let me know what you think. 
I just actually banged my head into it because it's a little low, I think, for me right now. I might have to raise it up. That's okay. Everything is a work in progress. Now, let me see. I like this Be Happy, but I don't think I want it here. I think I might pop it in over here somewhere because I like this cake. My daughter loves cake, so this is very appropriate. Cake here, and then I think... Since this is like kind of a matching piece, I am frame, yes, okay. I might just make it look like it's kind of falling out of the cake. I like that. And we'll put this here. So this is my classic. Like I said, I use this for my catch-all. Um, and I'm gonna be planning in my big that I use for memory keeping. So that one will be like all over the place, just like I did for my son. If you guys haven't seen that video, I think it was put up probably last Tuesday. That was his birthday. So I think that's when I uploaded that one. So go back and check that out. Um, but I'm probably going to go a little crazy and have it all be about her. So that'll be cute. So I might be saving some of these stickers to use for that as well. Let's see, a birthday present. Maybe we can have like a cluster, another cluster down here. These I'm gonna put on with this. I just don't know how yet. I think I might use the present. Maybe we'll scatter it. Um, let me see. I don't have too, too much going on on this week. So I do have budgeting that I like to get done on Tuesday. And errands that I typically run on Wednesdays. So maybe we'll do a cute little cluster here. Because I'll take care of my budgeting and, that, and then I can add in a couple more boxes just for any random things that I might have on Wednesday. I'm not sure if I want to add in washi let me see let's see what i have for washi let's see all right this is what i have for washi i really like this xoxo and i have a pink grid washi i believe they are both happy planner washies um but i really like how black pops off of pink so i think i'm gonna go with that let's see where that takes us okay so i like how this is going so far uh for mother's day i don't know if i have anything specifically for mother's day I have like a Mother's Day sticker that marks Mother's Day, but I don't think I actually have any, anything other than that. So we will probably just mark it Mother's Day, if I can find that. Father's Day, I'm in the uh, Wednesday luck we are planning. Love this sticker book. Did I say that? I think I already did. Um, Father's Day. Hmm. Mother's Day? Mother's Day. Okay, so yes, I do have that. All right. I think I might just be using these stickers today. I'm not sure. Maybe I'll pull a quote from in here because now that I'm looking at this all laid out, I do love this though. Dwell in possibilities. Maybe somehow. Am I in camera? I'm not in camera. In frame. Hi been a crazy few days in my house. Having sick kids is never fun. You know what? I do think I like this one with that. And then, let's see. Dwell on possibilities. I like this rest and restore. Um, I think maybe I might try to figure this out for Mother's Day because that's what mommy needs on Mother's Day after the week that I've had. And then maybe I'll put this on this side and we'll work that in there. Okay, I think I'm liking that. So let's start placing some of these down. I don't know if I like this yellow box. I'm not a fan of yellow. It's one of my least yellow and red and orange are my least favorite colors. <laughs> I like cooler colors. But 
yellows, and reds. Well, my kids like those colors, so I'm fine with it. I'm okay with that. I can go outside the box every once in a while. All right, this cake might be too big, so I might save this one for, I'm gonna take the sticker paper off <clears throat> so I can stick it back down. Because like I said, I have my big that I have to do also, so I might save some of these for that spread. I also have other stickers for birthday. trash over here. It's getting a little full. All right, what was I doing? Right, cake. <laughs> All right, so we'll put this cake back on here for now. I think I might use a smaller one for now. Yeah, that's going to be better. Be happy. All right, so I'm going to start on the left side, right side, hi, left, right, <laughs> on the right side this week, or for this spread, I should say. A lot of the time I start on the left and work my way over, but I think I really want to get this birthday section taken care of and then go from there. So that's going to fit in there. Put it up higher. Actually have it like right on top of it. Okay. Move this up a bit. And then I'm gonna add in this XOXO, make sure it's going the correct way. That's pretty, I like that combination. I'm going to put my box down first, and then I'm going to add in this happy birthday. And so the question is, I think I want to kind of put it off to the side like that because I like this birthday hat. So I'm going to add this in. Just like that. Oh, it's so cute. I love it. And the cake we will add here. Oh, I can't really see it too well there. Hmm. All right, I'm going to wait for a second on the cake. Ooh. If things get a little shaky, I apologize. I'm still working on my setup over here. <clears throat> All right, so I'm thinking I want to add this rest and restore at the bottom. I'm not sure how I like how that looks. I really do like it like the sticker itself, but I'm not sure if I like it with the sticker. So we're gonna just like kind of let that sit for a second and I'll come back to it because I really do want to use this. I'm gonna try to figure this out. If I cut it, I don't have to cut the top, but I could cut it and then I could add in. This matches very nicely, even though I have it there, but I could do something like, oh, you know what? Maybe we do a large one. We kind of just, how do we like that? And maybe I could move that here. All right, I do like this and I'm thinking here. I might put the cake here. Kind of angle it. Cake. And then we'll add these boxes to this. And put this little guy. I was starting that cluster originally because I wanted a place to put this cake. And I feel like this is not a terrible spot for the cake. So we're going to put the cake there. 
and I just smush that down and I want to wet out this line because I don't like it. So let's get my jelly roll. Yes, I like that. Good. Now, I'm going to work on this section because I do like this, so I'm going to put this down. The question is though, I do want to, I think, cut the bottom. And I want it to be flat because I think I want to add in this washi at the bottom. I think I'm in frame, I'm in frame. Yes. Trying to get better at that, guys. I'm a work in progress. Appreciate you guys sticking around and hanging in there with me. It's a little crooked, so we'll fix that. Now for this, this one's not straight, so we're going to try to straighten it out a bit. Okay, that's better. And then I'm going to trim the side of this. way this gives me a nice little like list because I like I said I'm hosting Mother's Day I'm hosting but now my mom and I are talking my husband and my dad into making us brunch or breakfast really um, I figure I'll make the kids some grilled cheese and there's the brunch part so we're working on that I personally believe that they should make us breakfast they're really good at it and this way my mom and I don't have to cook or do anything let me know what you think <laughs> let me know if you're on team um Aaron and mom or a team Joe and Brian so Joe's my husband Brian's my father <clears throat> take a vote and we'll see and then I'll just tell them sorry guys the the verdict's in <laughs> all right so this yellow box I'm gonna pop back on this side for now we're gonna move over to this side and deal with this big yellow box oh not a fan of yellow guys it's hard. This is hard, but <laughs> I can do it. I can do it. All right. Wait, cake goes this way, right? Cake. And then the slice. I like the slice. It looks like it's just kind of falling out. Uh, I want to wind out that line. Let's just figure out where. I want to take this line out. So if I have it like kind of tilted, oops. Let's pull this back. What are your plans for Mother's Day? Do you have any plans? I would love to hear them. A busy weekend. Spencer's birthday will never be on Mother's Day since she's born the seventh. But she was definitely my Mother's Day present. Both my kids were. I had them both very close to Mother's Day. So it was nice to be home and enjoying my new family and my new mom status. Oh, so many moons ago. <laughs> I'm gonna use this for my reminders my list of things that I need to get. Details, details. This is a Tombow, Tombow? Tombow Mono Air. I'm not sure how I feel about it. I think I just don't like correction tape. I seem to struggle with all of it, so I don't know if it's necessarily the brand or if it's the operator. <laughs> Let me see how I want to do this because I do like this cake down here. Um, what else do I have? I have the presents. I like this one too. So let's see. I have a present here. Here. Hmm. Um, there 
might not be bad. I think I like that. Let's do like a little cluster maybe. Not sure if the cake will look weird with it. So we might put the cake somewhere else, which is totally fine. Let's see how we like these. Like that. And then I do have another one. Or maybe I could cut this a bit, move it over, cut it, and then add it there. I wonder how that would look. Or even here, just to fill in this little spot right here. I think I'm gonna go for it, guys. Trust my gut and go with it. Put that there. And you know what? I'm not gonna stress over these lines. <clears throat> this and use this scrap this piece and then I will use the other piece if I can elsewhere that's cute I have just some cascading presents maybe add this in over here that and we'll work on this cluster that's going to be for Tuesday and Wednesday and I think let's see I have something down here I think this one would be good here and the cake I'll put the cake over there Add in my washi. Where do I want to though? I put it on top of here. See how this looks. Okay, I like it. side. I'm not worried about that little bit of green showing through because I'm just going to cover it with this black anyways. So we are good there. Cute, cute, cute. This box is crooked though. Let's see if I can fix it. Without damaging anything. I'm gonna put the cake down. I think I'm gonna put the cake in here. Okay. And let's see what else do I need. Thursday, I have a green box here. I guess we'll add some yellow in here. We'll go back to these. This little cluster I had going on. I think I'm gonna add a pink one. boxes they keep cooking on me let's try that again shall we like that and we'll add some washi on this side straighter. Okay. And we'll add this one. I really like this. I think this was in the, va the Valentine's Day happy box. Pretty certain that's where this one came from. Okay. What else 
else do I want to add? I don't have any more larger boxes. I have one yellow square. I'm gonna add down here. I have these that I pulled that I wanna use also. So, let's see. I have this yellow box that I could add here and then to kind of like break up the yellow a bit. Because <laughs> I'm not a fan. Oh, no. I could put it in this, this area and then break it up a bit by using this. I did that. And then did the washi under it. Instead of doing another green one, I think I might do a pink one. Okay, and then the washi I will add. adding any check boxes, checklists. I just have the boxes for that. Okay. I like that. I have this little pink balloon animal. Where do we want to put him? I do want to cut this back, I think. I'm going to put that guy there. Now, here, uh, that in there, I could add in a few gifts. Let me see if I have any in here and how they would look. Fill it in a little bit. Some balloons and some presents. To kind of fill in some of these uh <clears throat> these spots. There's a lot going on in this one. Be happy, happy be day. I don't know if I like that. I do like the box there. I'm not sure if I like this, be happy. So I'll put that there for now. I'm probably gonna place this box here. Let's see, what else can we add? Some hearts.
These are cute. A little bit of purple in here. All right, I'm gonna add this box and then I'm gonna move this wax paper. Oh, I just cracked my head on the light on the frame light. <laughs> real life, guys, real life. I will eventually learn that it's right there. But hey, look at the lighting, nice, right? <laughs> sure how I feel about these presents that are in here. Okay, they're not bad. I like them. We'll do a purple one. Pink one. Do the pink one over here. Cute, cute, cute. And I do have some balloons that would match. Maybe we'll put these behind this. I liked the balloons. I just wasn't sure about those colors with this spread. Yes, awesome. I like it. Let's grab another present. It's a little different than these, but that's okay. And let's see. Let's throw in some more hearts, and then I think that's going to do it. bring in these foiled hearts. They're not bad. So I think we're gonna, we're gonna go for it. If I can just find out where I want to put it. Put one there. Okay, that looks good. And then there's some smaller ones. I'm gonna add one over here on this side. I like these like little finishing touches. Right, this one is love. Put that over there. And then I'm gonna put some washi up here, I think, to fill this in a bit. It's pretty basic. It's, it's fairly um, simple. I do use this for functionality, so I try not to go overboard with the decorative and make sure I have everything I need. Because I could sit here and just decorate the whole page. I don't have too, too much going on though, like I said, next week. So I think that this is just the right amount. Some space here and here. I think we're looking good. We need to add in. Mother's Day. that there and then I'll add in a couple of pink hearts. Pink, purple, pink. Mother's Day. Okay, perfect. All right, guys, that's going to do it for me today. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to come play with me. I really do appreciate it. If you have not yet subscribed, if you would hit that subscribe button, it would be much appreciated. And go ahead and give this video a like if you liked it. And I will see you on the next one, guys. Bye. Bye.